looking back at some of those matches and through your career in WWE, one thing that I always find like interesting that, that was just a, a point, I guess, during your career was the <laughs> that you got from like your relationships throughout WWE. How was that being in the thick of that stuff and like the reactions that you were getting? Or, or how is that? Like I yeah. still, it's still talked about, um, you know, and my relationships are commented on on a regular basis, like on my Instagram still, you That's know, or social media. Crazy. But meanwhile, all of the men involved, you know, like, and, and mm-hmm. I mean, even like any, anything not controversial, like with being with punk or, or edge or, um, Matt, but like, it's like, I guarantee you, they don't get <laughs> asked about it. You know, like, I know they don't get asked yeah. about it because, um, they're dudes and they, you know, like it's that double standard. It's thing. an non-issue. Yeah. And so I think, I think that's at this point, the problem, like, like what I, what, like what I hold on onto which Mm -hmm. feeling like the double standard but I'll tell you it was not easy I mean I uh I mean for sure I almost quit like a month the whole love triangle angle but I mean but at that point not only was it so hard it was also like out of shame like I wasn't proud of the way I conducted myself and yes if I had to do it over again I Mm -hmm. absolutely would have handled myself different but I didn't and so I was very much like um you know, like make the bed and you lie in it, you know? And so I, and, and, and at that point I was kind of just like, uh, I deserve, I deserve all of these terrible things that everybody's saying to me. I deserve like not wanting to wake up every morning. I just, oh I my like, God. Yeah. and so that was, that was really difficult. And it was yeah. really difficult to, um, also as time passed, like let myself off the hook and being like in the only way you can move forward with your life. Sure. You, you learn from your mistakes and you keep going, but like, you have to forgive yourself. Well, it's also like, I mean, did anything that bad at, like, yeah, it's a thing, but like everyone relax a little <laughs> bit. There's a lot worse things that happen and have happened and continue to happen. Um, but yeah, it's like, do you think that you would get that same flack today if that was the case, or would it be worse because of social media? Right. I don't know. I mean, so it's interesting because obviously it's like, um, with age comes wisdom. So it's like, well, it's hard to hypothesize because that just wouldn't happen. Like, you know, like sure. I, I'm just like, I have a better skill set to communicate and navigate my day to day. Sure. But, but yeah, I mean, I, I was, that happened to me and there was very limited social media at that point. So I could only imagine in that current day and age with social media, but then now as I think that I would have more, I think I would have some people at least um, taking my side, whereas I just felt like literally everyone was against me um, and I felt very alone and isolated and just just was in a really bad place because also during a time like that, all that anyone is getting is the narrative that is being told on television. Mm -hmm. So you had no platform and no voice to be like, Hey, here's what really happened. Or here's my side of the story where like, yeah, they just deal with what was projected to them, which was this like juicy story on TV. Yeah that was just so intricately woven into what was actually happening in your, in your personal life. But like you got fed to the wolves. Yeah. And, and uh, so Adam and I had talked at the time, we were just like, because we can't unequivocally deny a 100% of what's Mm -hmm. being put out there. I, and I was, was not happy with how I conducted myself. I did, I didn't want to like act like I was justifying my actions or trying to make excuses. So um, I, we both just chose to be like, you know what, like, we'll just let it run its course. We'll, we'll, we will just conduct ourselves with grace, especially mm-hmm. because at that point, Matt was choosing to really take to the internet and get the, the fans behind him. So we were just choosing you know what, we're just gonna like, he can act that way. We're gonna, we're gonna stay just quiet. I don't know chin, if yeah. that was the best way. Like, I don't even know 
what would have been the best way, like g- given the fallout, like how, how else would I have done that? You know? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and we don't have to talk about this if you don't want to. Um, but I, cause I, we came up not all that long ago when you were talking about on your Twitch stream about just the that you went through and talking about that, the, you know, the infamous sex scene of you and edge on, on raw and just what that whole process of, we, do you want to talk about this or no? I mean, I don't, I don't, I really, it doesn't need to be like headline bull. I don't, it's well, yeah. And then that's what, it, what's what happened is it became headline stuff. At, and I, I looked at Twitch always as my clubhouse, you know, and, and, and also I, I never like breaking any stories there. I had talked about yeah. that. I was not cool with doing that. Like I've talked about that since 05, mm-hmm. you know, and it just never made any headlines. But now since we've fortunately evolved as a climate and society, it was like, shocking uh just not not that long ago but but yeah my my story's never changed yeah 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 I mean it's just it's so funny to like kind of look back now too to be like okay in that situation of like what you had to go through and like the narrative that was being spun about you being like the female involved in that it's like yeah it's just it's kind of like would it be the same today now that women have more merit and more of a platform to kind of stand on to be like uh it takes to the tango first of all but to just pin it on you like that and not be able to have a platform to actually tell your own story but anyways get it it's in the past who cares 